Hi all, my name is David Aviv, I'm Radworth CTO. I'll be introducing you Radworth's SDN solution, the defense flow control application. Let's first understand the SDN landscape. In the following slide, we see a simplified uh, view of the world in which on the bottom, we do see software defined data center utilizing physical and virtual fabrics, overlay or an underlay networks. We see the network, the wider a network, the wider a network itself. So what are the issues from the cyber point of view in this structure? You can see here points marked both at the data centers at the network as programmable flow enforcement points. Those are usually the points in which we would like to control the cyber policy, the cyber strategy. Those points consist the peering, perimeter, and edge networks typically in the network. So in that setup, we do see an SDN controller or controllers typically for data centers and wider networks and a set of a new generation of control application. That kind of control application can provide dynamic enforcement for the network. What we developed in the last two years, a new generation of SDN application, the first one called the defense flow. The defense flow goal is to utilize the network APIs in order to enforce cyber state into the network when we detect an attack. How do we do that? Let's understand the way we can automate a self-defensive network utilizing the defense flow. In that setup, we can see a core network, enterprise network, controllers and the defense flow running on top of the controller nosebound API. So how do we mitigate and maintain that kind of automation of the entire attack lifecycle? We do see attack running in, mitigated by the enterprise defense pro in that sense. By that, we're providing also attack meta information, metadata information to the controller. By the way, the controller can pick up open flow, net flow information, process, and provide that kind of statistical uh, telemetry to the defense flow. The defense flow will utilize behavioral algorithms in order to detect attack. In the case of an attack detection, we move from peacetime into attack time. The defense flow by that will create a set of operations in order to address and mitigate the attack. First one, selecting a mitigation device in the network itself, tune up the parameters based on actually the feedback got from the detection algorithm. Secondly, it will provide and change programmable policies in the network, such as traffic redirection, IP reputation, activating ACL. In this example, we can see a traffic redirection set up to the scrubbing center and running back to the enterprise to, as a clean traffic. Overall, we do see here a complete and life cycle attack mitigation and control correlated, addressed and controlled by the defense flow application. In a sense, when we look at it, we can see that here we have a combination of the data plan, which is the defense pro mitigation, and the control plan, the defense flow application. In a nutshell, we see that the BDOS plus SDN become, as we call it, the SDN killer application by helping and utilizing a complete control loop, incorporating the network telemetry the cyber detection algorithm, the automation of the attack, and setting back the network in order to be an address, as we say, a self-defensive network.